When an application is on board, the first version of the application workbook is created on the server. In our case, when we onboard our Acme Transactions and Acme Undertakings workbooks, the first version of the workbook was created. Versions are made up of two components, major version and minor version. For example, version 4.1 indicates the major version is 4 and minor version is 1. At any time, if you want to know the version of the application, you can do so by checking the system's properties and checking the version there. But then this is the version that is stored within the workbook. We can check the version of the application from our Velocity Design Framework 2 by clicking on Get EUC or System Template Version from the Utilities menu. In our example, both the server and workbook versions match. Let's ponder on what happens if the version of the application on the server and the workbook do not match. You can work in the application, however, when you try to interact with the database, for example, by submit or refresh, the first thing that is done is to check the versions for a match. If the versions don't match, the assumption made is that there exists, on the server, a later version of the application. Hence, the template advises the users accordingly and asks the users to download the latest template to continue working with the application. At this point, no changes have been sent to the database. The next question is, how does the version of the application change? Every time we publish our workbook, the minor version in the workbook is incremented by one, and then the same version is updated within the database where the application lives. What if I wanted to change both the major and minor versions of the application? Let's say after a big change was made to the application warranting and major version change. Well, this can be done by making the change in the workbook and then clicking on the set server version from the utilities menu. Boardwalk Velocity uses template version control to ensure all users are using the latest workbook, so as to avoid inconsistencies that may be caused by using an incorrect version of the workbook. This feature can be thought of as Boardwalk Velocity's way of managing source code control. In the next video, we will focus on building validations.